welcome back it's poppy in today's video i will share with you my jeans collection i am a jeans girl i wear jeans almost every single day and if you want to know where you can find some good affordable jeans that fit pretty well i'm going to give you all the details in today's video these are my jeans as you can see my collection is not massive i do believe that we just need a few jeans we don't need like 20 pairs in order to complete our collection just one jean in each uh, shade and style is good enough for me i will definitely try to grow my collection though i do want a couple more new jeans to add in my collection but for now these are doing the job i love them very very much i wear them every single day if i'm not wearing leggings i will be wearing jeans and i'm also wearing one more pair right now so in total i have one two three four five six pairs of jeans so when it comes to my height i am 1.68 and I am uh, normally a size uh, Europe 36 when it comes to jeans. So yeah, Europe 36 is my size and I will start with the jeans that I'm wearing right now. I will show you also try on clips for all the jeans. The one that I'm wearing right now is this pair of mom jeans. You will be able to see it better on the try on part. <laughs> this uh, pair of jeans is from H&M. It's a not super light wash, but not a very dark wash either. It's a medium wash, I would say. This one is super high-waisted, very comfortable to wear, goes perfectly with crop tops. And I will also try to find all these jeans or similar ones and link them in the description box so you can find them as well and pick them up so we can match. These are the only uh, pair of jeans that I currently own from H&M. I really like them and I would definitely purchase a pair of jeans from H&M as well in the future. The next pair of jeans I'm going to show you is this mom jean as well. It's from Bershka. This is my favorite pair of mom jeans. They're very flattering, very comfortable to wear. These though are a Europe size 34. They were running kind of big so I did sized down in these just to make sure that it would fit my waist and everything so this is a medium wash as well it has a few rips on the sides right here very discreet ones though nothing extreme and also a little rip on the back pocket so yeah these are my favorite pair of mom jeans i wear them more often than the H&M ones. So all the rest of the jeans that I have left here are from Zara. So I do recommend Zara jeans for sure. They have a great collection there. They have different styles. I definitely want to pick up a pair of mom jeans or straight leg jeans from Zara in the near future. But for now, all of these jeans that I'm going to show you are skinny jeans. I enjoy the look. I know some people don't like them anymore. They don't find them fashionable, but I think that skinny jeans go perfectly with boots, with booties, especially during winter, um, but also with sneakers. Two of them are jeggings, so they are also very comfortable, but all of them are comfortable. The first pair of jeans uh, is this one right here. I think these are called the sculpt jeans if I'm not mistaken and I have these in two colors. They are almost the same shade. This is a lighter wash and I also have them in a kind of darker wash but not really. You can see they're almost the same but not exactly. So these are both size 36. This lighter wash I've had for maybe a couple of years, if I'm not mistaken. And they are in a very good condition. I wash them very frequently and they are just in a very good condition. Nothing has happened to them. They are also very comfortable and uh, very soft. I do prefer when jeans are comfortable and, sh and, sh and soft. If you can scrunch them up like that, that means that they're comfortable. That's the secret. 
this pair I've had for a few months, I think. I bought them at the end of the summer, but they are comfortable too. They're very flattering. These are the sculpt jeans as well. I think that's how they're called, sculpt jeans, if I'm not mistaken. So I'm going to uh, link the exact ones down below for you. The next pair that I've had um, for a few months now, I bought these also at the end of summer. I didn't have a pair of black jeans and I wanted a nice, comfortable pair. Um, these are a size 36 as well. Very comfortable, super high-waisted. I really like pairing these with crop tops and cropped sweaters as well. One thing about black jeans that I've seen though is that when you wash them they tend to get kind of they wash off in some parts like it gets kind of white gray it creates some shadows on the material but i mean that's normal because they were not that expensive so even though they feel nice when it comes to black jeans you need to be very careful on how you're going to wash them so they don't wash off and turn white and gray but I really like this pair as well. It's very nice to wear it from morning to night. And the last pair that I have from Zara, of course, size 36, is a pair of gray jeggings. And these ones are super cool. They have rips on the knees. I've had this for a couple of years as well. This pair, I think, has washed off a little bit. Uh, but not that much to the point where you cannot wear them anymore. Uh, they are super comfortable. These are one of my favorite pairs and um, when they get very old, I will definitely pick them up again. And they have this detail on the bottom. And of course, all of these, you can just roll them up and have them looking kind of different, you know? So yeah, this is the last pair from Zara. So I would definitely overall recommend Zara jeans because I find them affordable yet of good quality. I mean, I told you that two of these jeans I've had for two years now and they have lasted me. They're in a good condition even though I wash them in the washing machine with hot water. So I would say that they are true to size. You don't need to size up or down. They're perfect, very comfortable, nice materials. So this is it guys. I hope you enjoyed my little jeans collection. These are definitely my favorite jeans. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, subscribe if you're new, and I will see you on my next video. Bye guys!